the vlog exclusive. We're going on my second ever TV show. And get the main man. What's going on? My fantastic beasts. And I'm a wannabe YouTuber. <laughs> Here we go, people. The title was not clickbait. I'm on my way to London and we are. We're going on my second ever TV show. Now listen, I'm gonna hold my hands up. It isn't an actual speaking role. I'm an extra. I'm not gonna to say too much, because I don't know in regards to confidentiality, but I'm excited for it. I'm actually on my way down on Monday because I've got to go and get a COVID test done. <laughs> Bit of a mission, but I'm gonna go home afterwards, and then I've got Tuesday, Wednesday shooting. From 10.30 till 10.30, both days. Stopping over Tuesday night. Very excited. It's funny, I don't feel that nervous. I think obviously because I don't actually have to talk, perform, what I have to do is be pretty. Shout out to Buzz Talent, my talent agency, for sorting it out. It is paid. Now listen, <laughs> it's not a ridiculous amount, and to be honest with you, I'll probably just break even. But I'm all right, I'm going for the experience. I'm excited for this. It's happening. To them people who say, Mike, why'd you vlog? Why'd you do YouTube? We're getting there. So fuck you. And I hope you <laughs> just a gaff. I get this feeling when I'm in London or Manchester, I just get that like motivation to smash it up. I've said this is a little bit of a nose to come and do this, but you know what, we're listening to stars, I have to do that, make a doubt of it, go to Cold Books and hopefully see Johnny Wilson so I can clip back the shit out of it. We're here. I believe this is it. This looks like a testing centre. See the white, see the white buildings? I'm excited, just bobbing around. <laughs> I do get a little bit nervous in London, I can't lie, I didn't wear the big watch, just went up a watch. I'm just a bit like, oh, I don't know, I just don't know. I just feel a little bit on edge. Do you feel me, do you know what I mean? I get that in pretty much any city. It's like pussy. It's the 26th of the 7th, 1997. And the first line. That's <laughs> all I have to do, apparently. Swab up one nose, done. That's good. Glad I came down to London for a minute. It's a bit, a bit fancy though. Oh, because I said, is this just for the production or is it just for like in general? Is this just for the production? It's a cold book. <laughs> Yeah, I've seen you. Yeah, yeah. You do it through YouTube, don't you? Yeah, yeah, YouTube. I had to come in to Carl Buxton, see the store as it was, and get the main man. What's going on? On himself. How are we doing? Can I ask you a question? How's the transition from obviously being in lockdown to now this opening? What's it done on like your sales and whatnot? I mean, to be honest, we've been in here every day because mm. this is our studio now. Mm, yeah. So oh, our is old it? studio will turn it into a gym. Was that far from here or is it? No, Tottenham. It's okay. Like North London. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know if you saw, we, we basically turned that into a gym. So yeah. all the lads that used to be in there are now in here. Mm -hmm. um, that's where we used to do the distribution from. Yeah. That's now being shipped from our factory in Birmingham. Okay. Well, in Dudley, actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's just nice to have customers back. Is it all mainly through online? This is just like your base now? Or is it a lot more people venturing out because we're obviously out of lockdown? I think, considering the times, we've been yeah. pretty busy. As I say, because we was working in here every day, mm. we saw how dead so it was. We just come here to shop. Mm. So, with lockdown being uh, in place, no one was walking about. Yeah. Um, second, we opened the doors again. It's been, yeah, it's been mm. busy, man. <laughs> Secure the bag. Oh, yes, we did. We went for the in store exclusive tea because we had to do it. We then went for the little crest hoodie black for my brother. He had to have that upgrade. We had to cut that short with Cole. Shout out to Cole for having the talk with me. But listen, I asked a little bit of a beefy question, a little bit of a stir in the pot because sometimes we have to do that. But I said I ain't going to put it in, and I ain't. The viewers, you're never going to know what was said. All I'm going to say is their blue hoodie. It's better than the other. 
car books are for the week. Here's a little Zara exclusive for you. I don't know about anyone else. Boys, they've been trying to look for the pleated shorts. Ooh. Fits, looks, a dream. Zara for the vlog exclusive. See you tomorrow, London. It's been, um, what some would say, <laughs> emotional. It ain't a bad life. Trafalgar Square with my new friends. Introduce yourself, boys. Elliot, Jermaine. Elliot and Jermaine. We've got British model, Vogue stylist. We've got what have you been on? What? Run you through some acting jobs you've been on. Nothing big yet, but soon to come. He's just been extra come. on yeah. Fantastic Beasts, and I'm a wannabe YouTuber. <laughs> I think it's going to be a long one. What time do you reckon we're going to finish tonight, sir? Late. Late? So we had to get a test at 8 a.m., then after wait, it's now 10 a.m. Apparently, we've still got an hour and a half. Not shooting till 12.30, and then 10.30 finish, which is early, apparently. Wanna be YouTuber? Big time. Wanna be. They didn't want me to have blemishes. Stop blemishes, it's rosacea. Stop shouting, man. It's a day two on set in London. I know I'm a big deal. Mike, you can't be that much of a big deal if you can't iron. What? I can iron? Because you have to wear the same outfit, I know, a little bit minging for the second day as well. For continuity, continuity. You know the drill. We do have some moaners on set, including myself. I don't know how the girls do it in the six inches because my shit flickers, oh, oh, oh. I don't want to show too much in set because I don't want to get told off. They were like, no socials, no socials. Okay, no problem. I can't lie, the first couple of hours, I was a little bit weirded out. It's a very new experience, a bit out of my comfort zone, but then you get, you get to know people. You get to be your normal self. Definitely annoying to some people, no problem. You can't please everyone. That's what I learned today, yesterday, in life. It was kind of like a night out. Get some numbers. Also, you're very, you're very nosy on the socials. I put a girls, because I'm doing a now come with the old hawkeroo. <laughs> Weird. And I'm tagging the girl, getting some nibbles. 800 views and then sticker taps of someone pressing on the name to see who it is. 2,000. Trying to work it out myself. I'm the exact same. Should we get a pret manger Let's get a pret and let's have it. Decent production, but they don't feed you much. Chicken, bit bland. I liked it. Everyone was like, oh my God, this is the worst thing ever. Try eating pot noodles. No beef. A bit of right? Let's go. Let's go. Family somewhere in London, you know it's the Hardaway. London was a vibe, I thoroughly enjoyed it. I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. This is what I want to make the vlogs. Fun, exciting, going doing bits. May 17th is here, it will be tomorrow. Excited for it, going inside now. We're still gonna be outside, because it's, it's getting warmer. It's not as Baltic as before, but I'm excited to go inside. Boogie Shed next Sunday. I think I'm gonna have this week off from the vlog and then make a sick one for the next week because I felt a bit burnt out. I want to be doing cool stuff, but I'm just working in the week. Got a big graph week, AMC. Cole Buxton, pleasure meeting you, sir. Very nice guy, again. Hopefully I'll be back down, see Johnny Wilson. I need you to subscribe for me. We need to hit that thousand subscribers. It's taken longer than I thought. I spoke to my therapist on Thursday, little debrief. You know you're actually getting somewhere with therapy when really all you go just for a catch up, it's nothing actually on your mind. So that was good. Tick for that. But I need you to subscribe because that will make me happy. Uh, I'm just gonna get to a thousand, they're gonna want more. But we're enjoying it, we're enjoying the process. Just stepping stones, as I like to say. I'm rambling on now. Like, come subscribe, I've said that. You've said that, Mike. My arms hurt, my legs hurt, my whole body hurts. I'm also, ah, cold showers. Yeah, shout out to Lewis, fitness, does fitness, 
met him. He was like, you tried cold showers. Oh, you know, it's... <laughs> but you feel like the... <laughs> it's been emotional.